almost 5,000 with like 70% win rate in solo queue and like 5,000 in part MMR. I would say my knowledge in Dota was insanely good, like way higher than my actually like execution. Because I watch pro matches all the time and pros. Like I lived Dota 2 for like two, three years. So my knowledge was really high. So I think I could at least get a bit above 5k. Which now is probably shit, but back then it was like pretty good. I played uh, my my favorite hero that I did the best with was uh, Meepo. I also played a lot of IO in group. I, I like to play flashy shit, so I was shit at my frame, but I was like, fuck it, dude, I'm gonna get good with Meepo. I think my Meepo had like 70% win rate, and on Dota buff I was like rank. I don't know my best rank, below 10, I think. I have like 3, 4, 3,500 maybe. We actually gotta focus a little bit now. We don't die instantly. Hey, what? I'm 11 years old and you're my idol. You have made my day to play with you. Really? GG's. When did you start watching then? Yalo, dude! Don't you run, man! Why is it so hard to tap this gun fast? Dude, I'm coming for that booty. Don't run, dude. Oh, shit. I think it's freezing. G give me something good. Okay, that's pretty good. This is not good though. This is bad, man. I need to find heat. Oh, this is this is this is scary, dude. This one is so good though. I'm not in range. Because you get a medkit as well. So I'm watching 1.6. Steam also counts like AFK time. Drop in core temperature detected. I played a lot, but I still don't think I played as much as I think myself, though. Probably like 3,500, maybe. Like straight play time, probably 3,000. Which is way more than I played like Div 2, for example. We know at least JLo is on the server. Axe was pretty fun back in the day. Holy shit, that was low. Did I swear I heard someone? How did the time? Another player have joined. Thank you so much for signing up to Marbles. For downloading Marbles and getting to level 2. Adding 15 more minutes to the stream. And even closer to the goal. Thanks so much for taking the time. Support me a lot. Hmm. What do we do though? Like I kind of just want to look for people, but that's not smart. Oh, okay. We do this. Yeah. 
with this purple AUG though. I was never a big fan of AUG meta though. I think AUG have pretty good uh, range for SMG. Trying to shoot him in the head and deal a lot of damage, then he don't shoot back. Which he did do. Come on, not electronics. Nice. We are, we are bleeding. Bleeding here. Taking some action. Detected. I mean, I saw there was one there. I don't want to use my medkit. I have two of those, so it's kind of... It's kind of... Always look on the map. I think this mode is pretty hard for new players, though. Like, it's not dying from, uh, from the from the cold, right? It got a pretty high entry point. Alert. Patient temporarily stabilized. Oh, look, another medkit. Like, you should order to have like 9,000 hours, but that's a lot of AFK times. I started it when I woke up and I closed it when I went to bed. But I was basically living in Dota 2 though. Because I was uh, doing YouTube videos. So I watched like almost every pro match. If I didn't do that, I would either play or I would uh, watch streams. We have like really good gear, I feel like. I wonder how many people are on the server though. We have to wait until either somebody DC or die. See that. Drop in core temperature detected. Okay, let's go and do a landmark, I guess. I kind of just want to go to dark kind of thing. This mode needs way more players though, like, even 24, it's like the map is too huge. Join the lines. They announced their team yesterday. It was like, the, I don't know any of those new players. I wanna, I wanna, I wanna flex a bit, okay? Is it not online? It's not online. God damn it, I always wanted to flex a bit. For Dota 2, people that know Alliance. Admirable. The, the, the golden days with Alliance, though, those were the days, man. TI Freeman. Dude, I'm getting so good loot, actually. Can I shake up line? Yeah, I'm gonna shake up line. Ah, you know that guy? I was making, at one point I was making uh, YouTube videos a little bit for NIP's Dota team, back when, uh, when Hanscan, I ran those guys played her. Core temperature is below optimal levels. From all this gear, dude.
Yeah, Pop is doing really well. A lot of shuffles this this, this season though. Like OG, Secret, Alliance, like I think a lot of teams are swapping players. Liquid. Like almost every like big team. I don't know about the, the Chinese scene. What was that like two three years ago no, probably three four years ago i was tempted to search uh, like alliance were looking for a video editor i kind of wanted to, to search that. i didn't talk i said I, w I would have to move and i was doing youtube and streaming Dude, i really wonder if it's only me and jaylen I swear you hear random footsteps. What's up, Sale? How are you doing? There is items here actually. Oh, it's a good box. Oh my god, that's like the best. Dude, the RNG I have right now, man, is just insane. M16 in this mode is insanely good. Like I got in so many purples and stuff. I don't know if I wanna go in dark and stuff. I swear, did you not hear that? That was not my footsteps. Like what the fuck? It would be cool to, to join a org. I feel like the last thing that I've never done in gaming is to join an org or play like professional, like play as a pro, right? That will never happen though. Becoming a pro just takes too much time. And most of the people that do it, they don't even like become a pro. Uh, they, even if you do it, Unless you're like winning a shit ton of tournaments, like you're not gonna make much money at all. There's a reason you see a lot of pro players go doing YouTube and streaming. Not that you make too much money with streaming and YouTube, unless you're really big. Like I'm literally just getting carried by sponsorships, that's why I can still do this. Damage to leak. Wait, why did I craft that even? We have so much time, so it's fine. I don't really have any reach these days, you know? Like, I have two little viewers. I'm not really relevant anymore, you know? We need another, another division game for that to happen. And I feel like Org that picks up uh, streamers, they usually pick up. I want to say reality streamers, but I think, I guess it's different. Like joining an organ, it's actually worth it. It's probably pretty rough, I think. If you just want to join an org, you can do that. But you probably won't get anything back from it. If you want to have like a deal that actually gives you something back, it's worth. I mean it's hard like the thing is I like to grind one certain game and if I don't find like a game that I'm super passionate about like what am I supposed to do like I don't want to become a variety streamer I mean if I could I would I guess but it's just I don't like it's just not me you know I kind of like to play like one or two games and get good at them like to be like a vr streamer you gotta have the personality for it. oh 
Honestly, I don't really, I don't really know what I want to do YouTube-wise. If I want to do guides or if I want to do gameplay, like I have no clue. The only thing I know is that I want to spend more time of the videos, make them better. Like I'm not sure what content I want to make. I mean, being a VRT streamer or YouTuber is the best thing, right? Because then, if your game die, like, you're still fine. I like Tarko, but it has so many issues. Tarko was probably, like, the last game that I was actually pretty passionate about. And I did a lot of mistakes. I actually think I could have done way better in Tarko if I made more YouTube videos. I think some of the talk of it as I did was pretty good, guide-wise. It, it was really hard, hard streaming-wise, though. And like, the only videos that did good is because like I, I kind of figure out. I just made pe videos that I knew people would search on. I wish I started Tarkov when it came out. Like, I actually had Tarkov before like anybody know knew what the fuck the game was. But I never got permission to stream it, like back in 2017, January, I think. I bought the game for 150 euros. I messaged them if I could get access to stream it and they did not reply, I think. I think one of the only guys that streamed back then was clean. Because I started Tarkov 2020, I think. But yeah, Tarkov is a really good game. Like, if you guys haven't played Tarkov and you like Dark Zone, like, I would definitely recommend to check the game out. Like, it's definitely one of a kind game. It's really hardcore, really grindy. How long have you been a YouTuber streamer? Since uh, 2013 full time. I started YouTube 2009. Uh, I went full time 2000, 2013 with Dota 2 videos. Till uh, 2016, and then I was gonna go to university and study. But then Division 1 came out, and I was like, this is my last uh, vacation. So I'm just gonna grind like crazy, and then I got lucky, I guess. All the grind pay off, and I just got viewers from nowhere, and it just worked out. Because when I went to Division, I had to start over. Even though my YouTube had like 50, 60k subscribers, nobody gave a fuck about me. Or Division, right? Because my YouTube was not about me. I was uh, making compilation videos and stuff for for pro matches and pro players. So. I was thinking about it like uh, a few days ago. Especially me having this sponsor. Like it's a bit... It's a bit draining mentally because like the thing is I'm quite sick I don't know if you can hear it but I'm quite sick right like if I wouldn't have the sponsor I would probably lay in bed right now like being a full-time streamer youtuber it's like it's really nice right but I also think it's not as nice as people think right unless you're really successful like if you're really successful it's really fucking good right But if you're not, yeah, it's not that great, dude. My cold is mainly sore throat. Okay, my nose have been a little bit bad today, right? But it started just with a sore throat. Same as last time. And it's really dumb that I'm streaming, right? Because it just makes the, the voice worse. But yeah, I tried to call in somebody <laughs> to take over, take my shift, but I couldn't find anybody that was called with, dude. I tried. Yeah, for sure. Like, the thing is, 
I, I am still like really grateful for my position though. But I feel like a lot of people, especially younger people, dude, like... Yeah, like streaming in YouTube, unless you're like super, super big, it's not that... It's not what you think it is. That's how you get warm, by the way. I have a lot of ups, but I also have a lot of downs. Core temperature is deep below. Oh shit, 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 shit! I forgot about this, dude. I forgot uh, it's sold out. I forgot that there's a lead, sir. <laughs> Why am I doing a landmark already? Is this quick enough? I think streaming on YouTube at, at my peaks, it was amazing. It's just hard to go from peaks to like when you drop off, I guess. Which I mean, I'm pretty used to it now, though. It's just my biggest issue is I don't have a, a game to grind. Like, that's what really pisses me off. Just sitting and waiting for games. I mean, I'll be playing a six year old game, dude. Because I don't have anything else to play, right? Twin Brother? That would be sick. never like the thing is i really want to enjoy destiny i really want to enjoy destiny because i feel like that's probably the game that would make most sense for me to swap to right but i just don't i don't like the pvp and i don't like the, the grinding in it i mean i will play halo i just don't think that will be it you know I feel like to me, like I need a game that is more than a shooter, right? I think loot shooters is just like... I feel like that's where I excel. I think honestly Tarkov is probably... the next best game for me except uh, Division, I think. But the game is pretty broken with a lot of hackers. And a lot of desync as well. I, I think uh, Tarkov is always going to be that broken game, you know? I enjoyed Outriders a lot actually, but it only lasted for, for a month. And they just updated it like a few days ago and it's just it's nothing for me to, to come back with. Sadly. But they're getting an expansion next year though. Evil Lion? Isn't that like super super sweaty? I think another game that probably would fit me well is uh, Rust. But it's also like one of those games like where you have to know life like crazy. Wait, did I use a medkit? I kind of want to, like, I love voice chat. Voice chat, I think, is one of the most, like, it's the funniest shit ever. I guess what I kind of want to try to do right now is I want to have a game with voice chat and I want to make videos with a little bit of editing, like, at least subtitle and funny moments, voice chat-wise. But there's, like, no game like that, though. <laughs> I just want Division 1, something similar like that, you know. You had really unique uh, group PvP. With voice chat. And yeah. I guess they said. 
could work. Preferably though, the game has to be new because it's really hard otherwise. Because like going into a game that's been out for so long, it's really hard to like get into the community, right? Like you have to do amazing videos, like insanely good videos to like get into it. Like to get people to watch it, right? Crab game? Dude, I actually looked at crab game and it looked pretty good, not gonna lie. <laughs> I definitely wanna try it out. Hunt Showdown? I played it in the alpha. Never played it after that though. Did you guys see uh, Cycle by the way? That was pretty fun. I was gonna make a YouTube video about it, but I never did. Frank on PC? Yeah. But he got like a huge uh, fan base though. In the they said right. Antiviral cash secured. Yeah, I don't know. Like honestly, I'm pretty fucking lost, man. Not gonna lie. <laughs> Not gonna lie. We, we will see next year what happens, I guess. I'm just kind of sick of like just waiting for games to come out. It's like, oh shit, you hear dude? Okay, at least there's two more people on the server. <coughs> Sorry, shut up. I ne never tried Warframe. I downloaded it, but I never tried it. Has the storm seem pretty fun, yeah? Battlefield is just broken though. I enjoyed it, but I thought it would be fixed with the day one patch, but it's still like got a lot of bugs, bad performance. I think I think uh, Hazard Zone have really good potential. But it just it needs more stuff in it, right? It got good potential, but it needs more stuff. We're paying new, new two maps in Marcia, FPS and graphic increase. Yeah, yeah. Kharkov halves. Like the thing is though, even with that, sounds amazing, right? And I'm gonna, I'm, I'm gonna give Kharkov another try whenever they release something huge. I was thinking when they release streets, at least maybe before that, but I think that game will always have a problem with hackers. They need to find a real solution for the hackers. And also desync. Those are two things I don't know if they can actually fix. Wait, I can't lift that punch. Warning. Vital signs indicate probable infection. Uh, keep the chat in English, please. I mean, my dream game would be uh, like World of Warcraft meets like CS. Like I want to have a MMORPG game that's a FPS, right? So I guess if you haven't played World of Warcraft, think like New World, but a first person shooter. It could be third person as well, preferably first person though, but preferably first person. That's what I want. I think that would be the game I want. And I've been wanting that for a long time. That's why Division interested me in the beginning. Temporarily stabilized. Do we craft more stuff? I don't want to craft too much. Because I think for me, like a normal shooter doesn't make it. Like it's not, it's not enough. Like, I need some progression in the game. There was a game like that before. What do we craft? Do we like go shotgun? YOLO? Huh. There we 
difficult way to do it. I don't wanna. I don't wanna die too easy. I'm not gonna craft like everything. I wanna do a holster though. Can we do that? Oh, I need electronics. Can't do that. Ah, whatever. That's what we Remnant from the ashes? It doesn't have PvP at all. Body temperature dropping below normal levels. Best PP level for 1.8.3. I mean, it depends on your, on your play style. Striker, Nomad, Pred, Deadeye, Hexo. I'll be afraid I'm gonna get backstabbed though. It's defiant. I think that could be fun, yeah. But I'm worried that it won't be enough. Oh, we have predatory on the gun. That's sick. Actually, sick. Really? We get balanced too, on it. I'm afraid I'm gonna get shot. Try banishing. Right now I'm doing survival. I don't know. I feel like Banshee is uh, an anti-rogue set, you know? Oh, we got a holster. Oh wait, where are we standing still here? Doesn't have crit chance though. Warning, malfunction detected. About even line, it's hard to raise the money in the game. I wonder if the other people have got into dark zone yet. I don't even know what I want to do. Like, I don't want to farm landmarks, it's kind of I want to find people. Probably it's the CR, yeah, I know. I don't want to get like too good gear, right? Because I know I got into Dark Zone first. Like, I don't want to be too over geared. Yeah, I mean, the day before looks really good, and that could definitely be a game that I would love, you know, but I think it looks too good to be true. I just don't, I don't trust them. It looks like they're just showing snippets and trying to get you to think the game is something that it's not. I hope I'm wrong, though. I should snipe, dude, in last time. Even though it's, like, pretty bad, third time. Oh no, that was an 
another guy. Where did you die, Mike? You died to NPC though. Was it in Dark Sun or? Why can't I see where he died? Four agents, so three. Okay, J Lo. What was the other viewer called? Damn, that's hella dead of Dark Sun though. There's at least two more viewers, huh? Hotland, if like we, I need the what? What is Hulse tablet called in English? Like I, we haven't heard much about Hotland, but I think uh, replayability is really important, and that's something they have to make sure that they make. I don't want to have my hopes too high though. Yeah. Hopefully it's good. I think it will be at least fun for like a few months. Minimum, you know, no matter what. Like a month or two at least. Hotline is gonna be EOA. Dead on arrival? I don't think so. I actually don't think so. It's a free to play game with Tom Clancy in the name and Division in the name as well. I don't think it will be huge though, but I don't think it will be dead. I might be decent. Wait, he doesn't drop a survival cash? I mean, no matter what, like, the, the rumor is that uh, Heartland is like some type of survival-ish game. Like, it needs to have, for me at least, it needs to have like, it, it can't be as slow as survival. Like, it needs to be faster paced and more PvP. And it needs to have progression system outside of like the, the survival BR or whatever it is. Which is not confirmed, but it's like rumors, right? If you look at cycle and it would have... Imagine, okay, it's survival. Similar to that. Shorter matches though. And they have a progression system like cycle. I think it could be really good. If they would even do it like cycle, <clears throat> that the server, that the server stays up for six hours. Wait, that's another hunter. I mean, I assume we're fighting, right? Wait, don't tell me the hunter is down here. Okay, we gotta kite for a bit, dude. I was close. Gonna put her down, nice and easy. I don't really know where is this guy is. But... We go in Dimitri's so like go big or go home, yeah? We're in the air in 30. Go big shoot up. We just leave him. Lifting off now. No 
Oh, I missed that one, dude. I don't know if we have more medkits. Nope. Oh, he died instantly. GG's, dude. I missed the chopper, though. Oh, I'll go there. Yeah, I had a little bit better gear than him. I got so lucky with my gear, though. Like, I got full purple. He had like one purple. That's why I didn't wanna. That's why I didn't wanna like farm up too good again. Because I think I got to Darkstone pretty quick. And I got pretty lucky with the gear outside of. Uh... Oh, Enforcer too, dude. Oh, let's go. Where you at, though? Oh, I'm cautious. Okay, he died there. I missed a lot of the shots, though. I was hoping to get a headshot, but I was kind of just trying to aim for like upper chest. Like I have a lot of mats, especially now I could go and craft like full high end. Maybe that's like what the JLo is doing or Enforce did. I don't know if I should go and craft gear. Because I don't want to be over geared. What, what should I do? Should I, should I go and craft something or no? Yeah, toggle rogue is kind of meh. Like I understand people not liking, to, like they don't want to go rogue and they accidentally go rogue, right? But still, I think that was better. Get small grip. Bro. We got a level two Marvel sign up. Thank you so much for downloading Marvel and getting to level two. Fifteen more minutes to stream. Two away from the seventy-five goal. Thank you so much for taking the time. Support me a lot. I had one blue though. Well, let's craft something knee pads, yeah? Those are pretty good knee pads though. Well, I guess that's it. I mean, I could fix all the materials here, but screw it. I'm too lazy. Uh, maybe weapon mounts. We can do a pulse actually. <laughs> Such an unnecessary one. I don't think <laughs> accuracy does too much to AD speed though. Nah, whatever. Let's go out. I should have bought medkits actually. Let's do that. Let's do that. That's what I should buy. Because I think I have zero medkits. No, I think I got one from him. And I actually need to buy some clothes. Actually, let's do that. We need some. We can do this. We need some clothing, dude. Yeah, we don't even have a jacket, man. <laughs> okay, perfect. How do you do that here? There we go. It would have been cool if they did a survival that was only Dark Zone. Oh, we got, we got a backstab dude. <laughs> that feels so lame, dude. <laughs> a 
I'm gonna let him revive. But now I used another medkit. It feels so lame to finish him there. He's just sneaking up on me. I mean, a lot of the, the fights in survival are not far. It's basically, like, survival is so long, right? You get a good start. Like, when you learn survival more. You're just gonna go quick scope, though. I can't hit his head, dude. His head is too small. Do esports for a game? Nah, it's not worth, man. You have to spend too much time. I don't. I don't want to sit and play video games like eight to ten hours every day. It's not worth. For like maybe to get a chance to like play professionally. I'm just too old for that shit, dude. Like next week, I'm fucking thirty, dude. <laughs> Potential though. Where are you going, Jello? Oh, 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 where is the barrel? Where is the barrel? Oh, he should turn here and shoot that barrel and try to kill me. Oh, it was there. I didn't know. It would have been good play otherwise. Nah, but it's just, it's too, like, being a pro player, it's demands even more than being like a streamer youtuber by a lot you have to do so many sacrifices for being a pro dude i have nine thousand hours in dota 2 with half of them afk dude and they, i probably have like one or one or two k played the rest is just spectating or afk but I wonder if Jayla has some adrenaline right now. I need to finish him with a headshot though. I tried to jump. I have uh, a friend. He was a professional Overwatch, Overwatch player, right? We're not that tight though, but we know each other a bit. And he stopped playing it because it's just the, the only thing you do. Like, it's just all about the game, dude. You have to sacrifice everything else. It's a bit similar to streaming on YouTube, though. If you like starting off YouTube and streaming, like, you have to sacrifice a lot, too. But as a pro player, it's even on, it's, it's on another level. Shit, where did it go? Like, you probably have to do, like, some boring practice, like, aim training and that, like, one, two hours a day. Then play pubs for four hours a day. Then do scrims for two, three hours a day. And every day is the same. You spend, like, 10 to 14 hours a day just doing that. Then you go and play a tournament. You're a pro player, but you are not the best team, so you rarely get to the higher spots. You just, like, place, like, maybe five out of... 12 or 24 other teams like let's say you are like a top six team right like there's no shot they will make a lot of money like they probably make uh, normal fucking salary dude i think it's probably fun for a bit but the longer you do it i think it, it just takes too much time and too much sacrifice like you can't do anything else while doing that because if you don't put that time if you don't put put down like 14 15 hours a day somebody else will sure a lot of it is talent but there's also a lot of commitment
and it's just the fact you com can commit those hours right while not getting out anything out of it I mean, I watched a video today, right, about uh, Dota 2, and yesterday. Uh, no tail uh, taking one year off. Because, yeah, as you just said, like, if you don't do anything else, then, like, Dota. But sure, like, if you're really passionate about the game and you do well, like, sure, like... If I had the chance to try it, I would. But like, it's not like I'm gonna start grinding a game now and like, yeah, let's go pro, dude. It would definitely be a cool experience, but... Yeah. Did I add 15 minutes or no? Shit, I don't know. Minutes or no? Shit, I don't know. 47. I'm just too old for that. Do we know each other a bit? And he's we know each other a bit. Appreciate the the Marvel 2 download and sign up. Fuck. <laughs> Appreciate the Marvel download and getting level two. Thanks so much. Increasing the stream by 15 minutes. Getting one cl one closer to the stretch goal. We won away actually. Easy clap. I don't know where he went. I followed No Tail since Heroes of New York, dude. Like I followed him since he was like. Was he like 14 or something? Like I followed his professional career since like he was 15. He's born 93 I think. Or 94. But he's been at it for so long. So I was really happy to like see him actually winning international. Not once but fucking twice. Now what though, dude? I don't even know what to do. What should I do, chat? I'm missing every shot, dude. Hey, where did he go? Running, dude. Man, he runs into J Lo. He's actually peeking now. How fucking tanky are you, dude? You were so tanky. <laughs> I got him with the shield, though, dude. I'm not gonna lie, that was a bit cheesy, but you know, sometimes you gotta do what you gotta do. <laughs> uh, like, if I'm gonna push there, like, I have to do something like that. Look at his blues, how fucking bad his blues was, dude. Holy shit, I mean... Or did you go electronics build? Did you do that intentionally? I <laughs> flame it, yes. Honestly, I was just too lazy to swap grenade, but yeah. I mean, you could have run away, though. But yeah, it was definitely cheesy. I 
damage. Yeah, that's really fucking unlucky with all the electronics you had. We just going close quick scope, okay? Yeah, we actually hit those. Should I revive? I should revive. <laughs> I, I would revive, but nobody gives a fuck about the gear, let's be real. Let's see your rolls though. Electronics. Electronics. Damn, all of you getting electronics though. But I would never swap like a purple piece to a yellow though. But maybe I'd like blue. Let's extract Dark Sun free. But yeah, that's the thing, if you get to Dark Sun first, you get such a big advantage. And of course my RNG this round was pretty good. Like I could have farmed way more landmarks and just like farm up high end. Because I got there pretty early. We get the dedicated patch, it's for uh, Elite Task Force. Flame neighbor, so cheesy. <laughs> I feel a little bit bad about that. I would have naded, because otherwise I can't push. But flame nade, there's like not much you can do. Now nah, we queued together. But Sally was only like five people in total, me and four more. David. Okay, we can go and shake it last time, Dark Sun, maybe. After this. It would have been fun, though, to do one match and everybody would work together, right? And you just get like a shit ton of hunters to spawn. I don't know how many you can get to spawn, though. Imagine like 24 players going here and 24 hunters. That would be sick. That would actually be so fun. And you would like only be able to use pistol, right? Imagine like 24 hunters here. Anybody know like how many hunters you can have? That's max. Incoming on your location now. I kinda want him to ask me. Loki. How long will you stream? Well, it depends. Okay, I'm just gonna push him like uh, crazy. Do I wanna die though? Wait, there's another hunter? Well, when the timer hits zero, stream ends. But you can increase it by... The only way to increase it is to download Marvel, get level 2, and then it adds 15 more minutes to the stream. Which caps out at 100, so I mean... Stream could go for 26 times 15, which is 390 minutes, divided by 60. So, I mean, yeah, stream could go for six and a half more hours. <laughs> I, I don't think that's too likely, though, but you know. What's about Division 3? I mean, they haven't said anything. I'm 99% sure we'll get a Div 3. I just think it's like years away. I can just pin this actually. 
pin. Can you pin on Twitch? I don't know. Spawn went down to the video. I actually want to see that. Now it's best to not use the link though, it's best to, if you're watching on PC at least, it's best to just take your phone and just go to the camera and just scan the QR code. That's the best way. Just gonna check that it works. Yeah, it works. Just take the camera, scan it, open it in the browser. That's the best way. 15 seconds. Nah, Div 3 is way, way further away, dude. Next division game is gonna be Heartland, right? Which, maybe if we're lucky next year. Latest, it will uh, launch uh, Wednesday 2023, we'll right? In the phone mark. Need you to get clear of the landing zone. Like currently, Massive are working on Avatar and also Star Wars, right? They have two big games they're working on. So like, unless another studio will work on Day 3, like it's far away. I would assume as soon as Avatar is out, they will start working a little bit on Day 3, right? But like, they won't work on free games at the same time, there's no way. I would at least imagine. Agent, I'm worried about you there. That's not a surprise that you managed to get out of that situation. You got some serious jobs. Now get back here and let's get to work. There used to be a pin function on Twitch. Hmm. How long was this though? It gotta be long, even though it didn't feel long. One hour. Do we get points for kills in this? Does it even count the kills? Probably not, right? 